welcome to today's video. I haven't done a what did I eat in a day video in quite some time and my diet has definitely changed. So I'm going to take you along with me and show you the recipes and just different things and I will let you know why I do them. Um, I just woke up so I'm just going to get ready, get dressed, all that fun stuff and then I will meet you out in the kitchen. We are now in the kitchen. So the first thing that I do every morning is take a shot of apple cider vinegar. Um, it's disgusting, it doesn't get any better, but I do it. It's really good for gut health, even reducing like belly fat percentage, um, things like that, I notice a huge difference. But I'm all about gut health, so I usually take uh, one of these on an empty stomach and then just chug some water. Um, yeah, not an enjoyable experience, but that is the first step. And because this one is mine and not my mother's, I just sip right out of the bottle. Oh, I do that dance every single morning. It's great. So the second thing that I have in the morning is MCT oil. I buy mine on Amazon because it seems to be cheaper, so I'm really happy with it. But I use it in my salad dressing, I use it in my tea, which is what I'm going to do right now. So I just use green tea and I put a little bit of this in. I do not put much because I've learned the hard way that if you are on an empty stomach and you use a lot of it, it will hurt so bad. So um, yeah, unfortunately I had to learn that the hard way. So just do a little bit. I usually just probably do like even a spoonful, um, nothing too intense, but it's great to get your fats in um, since I do do the keto diet, so. Okay, so I have my tea now and I'm good to go. Uh, most of you probably already know this who are watching, but I do work from home remotely, so it's an awesome job and I absolutely love it. So I fast, so I just basically drink my tea until about 12 o'clock and then I will either eat or work out, um, depending how long I work in the office for and I usually just do chunks of my day um, spent on my computer. So I'm just gonna do some work and then I will check back in with you later. After 12 o'clock and I am super hungry. I haven't worked out yet, I've just been working and I decided to eat first rather than burning out in my workout. So I'm just gonna make a quick salad so I will show you what I'm putting on there. I love to use um, just regular lettuce and then mix it with some spring mix, so that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, ride or die is this hot and spicy pickle. Oh, love them, that's the best. So I'm just gonna top it with some hemp hearts for some healthy fats. I have an onion, and then I get this from Costco. Um, it just goes in the microwave for like a couple minutes. It's really fast if I like don't have anything else, which I don't. So of course not like the best option, but it's there. Um, and then for my salad dressing, I use apple cider vinegar, the MCT oil, and then I buy this from Costco. Um, this is like so delicious. I find if I don't have it on here, I definitely notice a difference. So here is the finished product. I ended up adding some avocado on it and some pumpkin seeds. For those of you that were asking me about me eating meat again, um, I actually like prefer not to eat meat and I was, wasn't, I should say, for a while. Um, but then I got an infection in my small intestine that required me to do like a super low carb diet. And with like eating beans and stuff all the time, that didn't really fit it. Uh, so this is sort of just like a temporary thing until it's good, I'm back to normal, and then I'm gonna try to implement beans and stuff back into my diet. So I still try to get protein a lot from like pumpkin seeds and hemp seeds, chia seeds, things like that. Um, but in the meantime, unfortunately, I have to eat meat. So anyways, that's the reasoning. So eventually I will go back to my old ways, but for now I unfortunately have to eat meat, so. I'm still working away and I was getting a bit hungry after my salad, so my, oh, I don't even know where it is, right here in front of me, my favorite. So it's raw almonds and stevia chocolate chips. They were so good. It's a really good low um, like calorie snack, or sorry, not low calorie, low carb snack, but it's high in calories. So I don't tend to eat a lot of food throughout the day, but the food that I eat 
um, does have a lot of calories in it so that's what works for me and then I always just am constantly sipping on tea as you can see here and mason jar water I always call it that because it's like I love drinking water if it's out of a mason jar like, I don't know if I'm the only one that's like a weirdo like that but if it's like a nice jar you're like heck yeah Okay, so I did a quick workout and then I'm going to have some BCAAs and my friend Sarah came to visit. So we are going to decorate the tree and hopefully it will look a lot better than it does right now. So I will let you know, hopefully, yeah. Mm -hmm. So we'll see, we're gonna, if we have some weird icicle tinsely things then we're gonna make it work. So flash forward and we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. So wish us luck. I finished dinner which was ham soup so we used almond milk in it and there was some veggies and then potatoes so I just tried to not have as many potatoes to keep it low carb and that was really good and then with that I had keto bread which is amazing it's so like buttery and it's nice and then my mom fries it in the pan so it's like crispy on the outside so very satisfying uh, as far as dessert goes I have two things that I might have so either fat bombs oh they just fell out <laughs> keto fat bombs so there is cranberry orange and then just uh, orange zest which are really good um, and then we also make chocolate ones which are in the freezer at all times and then the second option that I might dig into are these keto peanut butter cookies so the chips in them are actually the stevia chips which I've um, shown in previous videos and they're amazing and I love them so that's probably gonna end my night and I'll just drink tea sip on that um, and other than that, that is my full day of eating and wildness setting up the tree. So I hope you enjoyed it and have a good night. Update, I decided to eat the peanut butter cookie. So good. Now for real, have a good night.